Today I am proud to introduce Singapore's first metal recovery plant for incinerated bottom ash. This milestone marks a pivotal step within Singapore's long-term strategy to ensure a full recovery of residues from solid waste incineration. This facility is the first of this kind in Asia. It is a result of successful collaboration of the NEA of Singapore and Remex. The moment the contract was awarded to us in 2014, we were faced with two challenges. Space constraint of 1.4 hectares and a tight timeline. The goal was to create highly efficient plant by maximizing the resources available to us. We began construction in October 2014 and within eight months, we have achieved exactly what we planned. The metal recovery process reduces more than 10% of the volume of the bottom ash that's sent to a landfill, effectively extending its life. At the Remax 1.4 hectare purpose-built facility, incineration bottom ash, or IBA, is received daily at our ash receiving hall where it's stored and dried then fed to the input feeder for processing Once at the first station the bar sizer screens the fresh IBA and removes any material bigger than 150 millimeters and the excavator's magnetic attachment eliminates all bulky ferrous material. Back on the conveyor belts, fractions of ferrous metals are separated into metal bays by overbelled electromagnets. Then at the flip flow, the IBA is sieved into various granular fractions and channeled onto the designated equipment. On reaching the advanced dry recovery, a high-speed rotor isolates the lighter material onto a conveyor which transports it to the discharge hoppers. While the heavier fractions are channeled to the flip floor for sieving and then to the eddy current separators for separation. At the eddy current separators, non-ferrous material is separated from the IBA as it passes over a high-speed rotating magnet below the conveyor, where out of a total of eight eddy currents, three are arranged in a cascading configuration for efficient recovery of smaller non-ferrous metals. At the last station, the manual handpicking station, a team handpicks stainless steel and any remaining ferrous and non-ferrous materials to ensure most of the metals are recovered. Finally, the processed IBA is transported to the discharge hoppers that automatically load the ash tipping trucks for transfer to the Twas Marine Transfer Station. and the recovered metals are loaded into containers for delivery to customers around the world. Processing more than 600,000 tons of IBA a year. Recovering up to 90% of ferrous and non-ferrous metals. Remax helps reduce land filling rate and Remax metal-free processed IBA can be treated for various applications making possible zero IBA to the landfill. Remax Minerals, your partner in working for the future. <laughs>